wrath. It's one of those things that if you don't control it, it can quickly turn into other evil acts. Because it brings that, that feeling of in, intense, you know, you just have this intense feeling to hurt someone, to punish them. The Psalm 37 verse 8 says, Refrain from anger and forsake wrath. Fret not yourself. It tends only to evil. Do you struggle with wrath, with anger? Why do you allow it to control you? Because if you have God's Spirit in you, you have the spirit of self-control. So you can control it, yes. You can control your emotions. Don't lie to yourself. Some people say, ah, this is how my family is. My dad was this way, he's dad, so I'm just like him. You are the one that should break that chain. And you can control it because if you are a reborn Christian, the Spirit of God will help you to have self-control. Ephesians 4 verse 31 says, Let all bitterness and wrath and anger and clamor and slander be put away from you, along with all malice. If you give in to your emotions and you just vent, you are a fool. I'm not the one who says it. God says it. Proverbs 29 verse 11 says, A fool gives full vent to his spirit, but a wise man quietly holds it back. You know, the Bible is full of verses that warns us against wrath and anger. It's so serious about it that it actually warns us not to be friends with someone like that. Proverbs 22 verse 24 says, Make no friendship with a man given to anger, nor go with a wrathful man. If you are a real Christian, a reborn Christian, you are a new creation and God's Spirit is in you. And yes, as a new Christian, you are now a baby in Christ. So you still need to learn how to act in the Spirit and not in the flesh. But you need to do it. You need to put on that, it's like a switch that you decide, no, I'm not going to give into emotions. I'm not going to live in the Spirit. What would Jesus do in this situation? If you walk in the Spirit, you will have self-control in every aspect of your life. Galatians 5 verse 22 says, But the fruit of the Spirit is love, joy, peace, patience, kindness, goodness, faithfulness, gentleness, self-control. Against such things there is no law. Take my life and let it be consecrated, Lord, to Thee.